This year, approximately 3,500 new Albertans will arrive in this place, easily the most ever that this hospital has seen in its history. The new neonatal intensive care unit is expected to be completed summer 2019, and it will also benefit from the expertise of the Stollery Children's Hospital, which will operate the unit here. Having the neonatal intensive care unit in St. Albert will help newborns, but it will also reduce stress and anxiety that the families with these sick babies have. Instead of having to travel to one of Edmonton's larger hospitals, they can stay together close to home. And in the really difficult cases where babies do need to be moved, the sturgeon can be a place to return after that uh, urgent time. So this neonatal intensive care unit will make life better for St. Albert families and for those in the surrounding communities as well. It's part of our commitment to strengthen services that Albertans count on and to invest in our critical health infrastructure where it's most needed. The health of our province starts with the health of its children. With the government's $2.3 million investment in infrastructure and our donors' $2.5 million campaign to invest in state-of-the-art equipment and family-centered space, the new Sturgeon and ICU will provide excellence and care for neonatal babies that will serve the growing population of St. Albert, but also its surrounding areas, and keep families closer to home where they heal best.